We are here with Christina Harris after she gets career singles win number 100 here at Virginia Wesleyan. Christina, how does it feel to reach this milestone? Um, really good, I guess. <laughs> um, no, it was really fun. Um, it's something that I've been working towards all year. Um, when I came in as a freshman, I didn't even know it was possible to get 200 wins. So I'm just really excited and really happy that I was able to accomplish it. So yeah. Yeah, so you wake up this morning, it's about a three and a half hour drive. What kind of mental preparation do you do for a, a match like this? Or were you thinking at it, about it at all? Um, I just told myself that I can't lose today. <laughs> <laughs> I woke up and I said, this is a big deal. And you can't just go into it thinking that you're going to win. Um, so I just walked into it that I had to try my best and hopefully get the win. So you won the first set, dropped the second, made things interesting. Uh, but then you won the final set with a 6 nothing score. What were you thinking about in the match? What kind of adjustments did you have to make? What were you, what were you telling yourself? Um, I honestly couldn't really figure it out on my own. Um, when my coach came over, we kind of like got a game plan going to just kind of work to the backhand side um, and then take the points from there and look when I can come in. And then that started working out for me. And so I said, I'm going to do this the whole time until it stops working for me and I need another game plan. So I just kind of had to go back to the basics a little bit. So Yeah, so of course, Coach helped you today. And the team won as well today. So what do you have to say about your teammates and just the program overall to help get you to this milestone? Oh, it's awesome. We're 15-1 and one right now, which I think is the best start that we've had, I think. So yeah, I mean, my teammates are awesome. They always support me. And I've been here for a while, so I've had lots of teammates <laughs> over the years. So it's nice that just consistently um, we've had such a great culture with the team. And it's good that I know that whether I'm winning or losing, my team's always sitting here cheering me on. So, yeah. All right, so you get to 100, but there's room for some more. Uh, as you said, 15-1. and one. What is the expectation for you and your team the rest of the way here as the season wraps up? Um, we have, I think, two more matches before ODAC, so um, obviously go into those hoping to just play our best tennis and get the win for those. Um, and we have another match tomorrow, so hopefully we'll be 16-1 and one after that. <laughs> but yeah, we just go into every match playing our tennis, and if we have to make adjustments, we do. But I think it's good that we go into every match with a game plan. All right, well, you heard it from Miss 100 Career Singles Wins herself. Congratulations, Christina. Thanks. We're here with the coaches of the Lynchburg women's tennis team, Chris Johnson and Reagan Kuhn. Uh, but Chris, coach, you got the win today, which is important, but also a great milestone for one of your players, Christina Harris. What does it mean to see one of your players get to that historic 100 wins? Well, it's like you said, historic. I mean, nothing, there's been no other players that have done that in the history of Lynchburg women's tennis. So uh, Christina's the first, and it's, you know, no surprise Christina set so many firsts in her six years here. And uh, so we're really proud of her. And, uh, she, you know, when she decided to come after her four years and the COVID year took away her senior year, uh, we, you know, we just kind of put a landmark in place and mm -hmm. said this is what we're shooting for. And so to see her hit it, uh, again, no surprise. She's, she's uh, accomplished so many things, but it was really special. Mm -hmm. So what, what did it take for her to get here, do you think, as her coach, working with her for five years? What did you get to learn about her as she made her way towards this milestone? Well, she's really grown mentally. Uh, you know, she came in with a game uh, that we could work with for sure. She's a really talented girl. And uh, so as we taught her a little bit of patience on the court, kind of how to use her weapons a little bit more, um, as she's gotten older, she's gotten a lot more mature in how she plays the match, how she finishes matches, how she starts matches. And so, you know, to me, it's uh, really special to see her finish well. All right, now on to you, Reagan. You, you were there at, on the bench with her during the match. What were you telling her as she made her way towards this milestone today? So mostly I just try to calm her down, you know, keep her head in the game because, you know, the second you lose your head, you, you lose chance at mm -hmm. winning. And so I tried to, you know, lighten up the mood, you know, crack a little joke, you know, pick on her a little bit, you know, bring her back down. And then I talk about more strategy, you know, like we noticed. Attacking the backhand usually worked and like staying patient in the points and you know working up into that ball you can be aggressive on. Don't just go for just a random ball. You got to work your way into the point. So I really just talked with her about you know proceeding through the point to win it, mm -hmm. you know, and being patient with herself. 
All right, well, you guys got 100 wins out of Christina over her career, but also 15 wins out of the team. What is the expectation here? What do you got your mind set on heading into the rest of the season? So we just take every match as a new match, you know. Of course, we have the momentum going up, you know, 15 wins. So we're going to go into the next one expecting to win, you know, mm -hmm. because that's what winners do. We yeah. expect to win. But, you know, we just take it as a new match, mm -hmm. as a new day. You know, we go out there, play point by point, you know, game by game. You know, we just go out there brand new and play our tennis. You know, we don't stoop to another team's level. We continue to play our game and just go out there and Never give up. That's what we do. Well, excellent coaches. Congratulations. Keep the momentum going and good luck the rest of the way.